Russian Federal Security Service and police officers searched the Moscow office of the Research Center for Automated Design Systems. The enterprise is part of the Tactical Missile Armament Corporation, which produces the Circon hypersonic missiles. The company Serena Travel was also searched. The media note that nothing has been reported about the reasons for the such measures in the Office of Research Center, but the search in Serena Travel is related to large-scale attacks on the IT infrastructure of the Russian ticket booking system, which the company faced last autumn. From the publication in the Krim Rally. According to the journalist, the security services are examining the equipment to identify possible vulnerabilities and also seized the necessary documents of the company. After the inspection, the law enforcers took five people away from the building. The representatives of the Research and Development Center said that the detainees were not their employees. It is not known whether the searches at the Research Center and the Siren Travel are related. <laughs> Everyone paid attention to this because last year a large number of Russian engineers and physicists were prosecuted on charges of state treason. And these were almost all developers of hypersonic missiles. Most of them were employees of the Siberian branch of the Russian Academy of Sciences. 16 people were imprisoned there. In 2023, three scientists from the Novosibirsk Institute of Theoretical and Applied Mechanics, who were involved in the development of hyperthonic aircraft, were arrested under the Article of High Treason. And at the end of December 2023, their co-author, Vladislav Galkin, was arrested in Tomsk. The investigation against Alexander Kuranov, chief designer of the research and development enterprise of hyperthonic systems, professor at the St. Petersburg State Polytechnic University, has been ongoing for several years. He is also also suspected of treason. In total, more than three dozen scientists have been prosecuted and arrested in the country over the past 20 years. This is very similar to the Stalin's period, when the biggest aircraft designers were sent to camps and then in some poorly organized bluffing organizations. And now the situation is literally replicating. Let's remember that one of the Russian physicists died in prison. We see the complete lawlessness of the law enforces. I have a feeling that some physicists finally understand something and realize that it is impossible to work for these people. According to experts, Ukraine has the necessary means to shut down Russian ZM-22 Sarkon airship hypersonic missiles. It's a very, very fast weapon. If we're talking about Zircons, it's about 8 to 9 much. That's incredibly fast. However, when these missiles enter the impact trajectory, their speed drops. It becomes subsonic, about 4.5 much. And that's when we can use our anti-ballistic missile systems. These are SEMP-T Patriot, which can inflict powerful damage and shoot down even such weapons. Ilya Yevlash, speaker of the Air Force of the Armed Forces of Ukraine on the air of Ukrainian National Telephone. There are three known cases of Circon missiles being used on Ukrainian territory December 30th, 2023, February 7th and March 25th, 2024. All missiles were shot down. Reported by Anastasia Tarnavska, Viktoria Smirnova, UATV News.